non-scale victories in your weight loss journey. These are five I've noticed over the last year. And things you should be on the lookout to for, for two, <laughs> while you are on your fitness journey. Clearer skin. Look for clearer skin as you start to truly focus on your nutrition. You're gonna watch your skin clear up. Why is this? Because you're probably focusing on a more whole foods diet. These foods are more nutrient dense, so they're packed with more vitamins and minerals, which could definitely lead to seeing a clearer complexion. Fruits and vegetables have a higher water content, which proper hydration is essential for your skin and its elasticity, so things are looking more plump. This kind of goes without saying, but your clothes will start fitting better. I would highly, highly recommend not getting on the scale, at least not daily. It can be a good representation of the changes going on. However, I highly recommend tracking your inches over your weight and just how your clothes are feeling. They'll start to get looser, like looser. <laughs> and that is just a confidence boost in itself because we all know the struggles of just getting dressed in the morning sometimes especially when you're carrying more weight it could be daunting look for a better quality of sleep because it is going to happen on your health and wellness journey you are going to probably start supplementing things I recommend magnesium in the evening you're going to have exerted yourself physically with your exercise which causes you to sleep better you will definitely notice increased energy not right away though so when you first start working out or at least anecdotally i was definitely more fatigued at the beginning of my fitness journeys like workouts were a lot However, as time progressed and my endurance got better and my stamina, our stamina and endurance the same. Anyways, as you keep doing it, you're increasing your blood circulation, you're increasing your metabolism, you're increasing your endurance, you're increasing just like your physical health, which will then contribute to just overall more energy throughout your day. I promise this is my favorite favorite, favorite non-scale victory that I've personally had. I'm a mom of a 10 year old little girl and I'm just very involved in community. So to have that extra energy to do stuff is incredible. Lastly, your confidence is just going to shoot through the sky. This is because the exercise that we're doing is increasing our endorphins. It triggers those endorphins to just flood our system. We're feeling confident. We're taking care of ourselves. We are putting in hard work, which makes us feel satisfied. So physically things are happening in the body that are releasing like these feel good hormones. But then mentally too, you're just, you feel like a sense of control as you embark on a fitness journey and you stick to it. You're keeping your promise to yourself finally and all that hard work and that just the daily grind and sticking to it produces this confidence and then you just like actually physically see it too. At first, you know, you're kind of talking yourself up about it like, you know, just like you're just proud of yourself for like doing it and sticking to it this time but then it starts to produce more physical results. So confidence is a huge non-skill victory in your weight loss journey. I hope that this truly helps you focus less on the scale and more on just the overall changes that will occur when you implement more balanced nutrition, physical exercise, because sometimes the scale will not move, the inches won't be falling off, and you need to look at other victories that are occurring from the clearer skin to the better night's sleep sometimes it's not just a physical weight change it's more than that have a great workout today i'll see you guys again with more just mindset shifts and things to look for beyond the scale